Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how we can use reference images in creating an image with a neat journey. So let's get started. So first, what we want to do is, of course, go to pmejourney.com so that we can access this and join the Discord server of Midjourney because we need that so that we can use the AI of the journey, so let's go click here on join the beta. And then when you click that, you will be directed to the uh, Discord invite link. And you want to accept that so that you will be very good there. You will be here in the mid-journey Discord server. And as you can see, here in the server, there are a lot of people using it here. As in, here are the examples of people using the journey to create their images using it for whatever purposes. As you can see these are really good images, high quality, and there are a lot of servers here, like phone chat. You can discuss with other people here. So you can see, but you need to have permissions to send messages to this channel. But here in newbies, you don't have to. We can just type here what you are here in like create an image here you can do it right here so as you have joined this discord you may also want to sign in here so that you can as a surreal so when signing in it will be you will be prompted here you just need to connect your google account or I mean Squid account and you will be prompted here and here you can see that option to purchase a plan and here is this our plans for the journey for yearly these are the basic standard and pro flag and it is yearly billing you can say it's much more than when you choose monthly during there is really a huge difference so you might want to really think about that and now let's go back to the dashboard here so if you want to view the examples of what the journey can do you can click here and show this and it will show you the boost one a hair is there here as you can see these are really cool images that you can use and um, yeah you can choose this one I specifically like this one bro the quality you know the high quality images it's just that it is so real like there is no sign of pixelations here that is happening and it's just really on point to what is the uh, if the user has prompted to the AI Spider-Man from Marvel Cinematic Universe, stylized you look with black and red symbiotic suit, gold color, and as you can see, it is really on point. And now let's go back. So we, what we want to do now is go get our reference image from Google or from whatever resources that you want. Let's say one hit. We want it in Google and we want to have my sure because our image will be about shark. So let's go here and let's say we select this and now let's download, save image as image as and you have to make sure that it is like this here. It's JPEG or JPG or BNG. You don't want to download any of other files, otherwise it won't work. So make sure it is PNG or JP, JPG. And next we want to download, of course, the, uh, this one. I have downloaded it so that it can be easy. It's here. Like this, as you can see, it's JPG and JPG. I this could work. And now what we want to do is go back to the Discord server. And in here, if you want to just go and start here in this channel or the server and then you can also do that but in this example I'm going to show you how you can add a server and add the majority bot into it so that you can do your uh, prompts there and edits or request to the majority bot so first let's go create a server let's still click here add a server and then create my own or uh, just for my flaming reference and uh, let's see it let's say my majority example there create and in here we have the server now 
And now what we want to do is add the Midjourney bot into it. So what you have to do is simply find the Midjourney bot this chat or in here. It depends on where you want. Let's say we want to here. Let's just click this name. And we have the options at the server. So we're going to click it. Let's say no click. And then here you want to select the server that you have for Aiden and that. In my example, it's the yeah, Midjourney example because that is the main that I have support and offer raise. Here I am a human. Then after that, after this pop up that it is all the rights, it is now successfully added to your server here. As you can see, Midjourney bot was now here and it says I was using the journey bot as a fear. So let's type slash. Here let's type slash. And as you can see, these are the commands that you can use in the journey mod. So first let's view info. And as you can see, this would reveal your info, your account info, your driving in the journey. And as you can see, my subscription is trial and my fast and remaining 25 minutes life and usage, two jobs and SR. So now what we want to do so that Midjourney can use our reference image is upload our image sphere in the chat. So as you call it, let's just drag it so that it's easy there. And next, this one, make sure all your uh, your images is uploaded here. And then you have to your enter. And then here it's now uploaded. So what we're going to do now is go type slash then imagine and this one you want to have this command here it says pro and this is where we will be stating our specific instructions or specifications on what you want to do and what you want our image to look like so let's say we want since we want to have this reference image included in the prompt then we should click here and you want to Copy, copy the human name, copy link here, and you want to paste it right here, and then press space, and then you want to go to the next photo, and then you want to copy the link, and then go back, and then here, paste it again, and there you go, and space again. Then after you have put the links of your reference images here, you need to click on space and add your specifications a bit more. Let's say we want it in a, mo in a modern painting style, modern painting, and then come up another specification. Let's say you want, you want this all track. I mean, let's just say HQ, high quality, high quality, then 4K. And we also want to add on double hyphen where it will dash there and then press V so that it means version and add four. And what this means is that there will be four variations or four versions of the images that the journey will provide so that you can choose very well and hunt. So after you have done inputted your Specification, let's now click enter. And as you can see, I can access it because my because my subscription is on the trial and I need a subscription to go use the journey. And also I can use my free trial right now, even though I have no free trial and I haven't used it yet because I'll put true in demand. So what I'm gonna do is just show you the reference images here in the Discord server. Here, as you can see, here they are. And this is what I'm talking about, this V1, V2, V3, V4, as what we have inputted here on this V4 command right here. This is what it looks like here in the journal. So what this basically means is that if you click on V1, it will create versions of this photo and V2 versus this photo and so on. And for this one, U1 to U4, it means upscale, upscale image one to upscale image four. If you want to choose this one, then you should choose V1 so that it would be upscaled, then you can download it and use it freely. 
And after that, that is basically it for this video. And that is how you create your own image here using reference images. So that's it, guys. If you just use the comments correctly, you will be able to achieve this with a subscription or a free trial as it is available.